Hello everyone, welcome to Precious Dogs. Today our puppies are exactly three weeks old and we have started weaning and potty training them. In this video you can see that in their little nest we have a sleeping area for them and we placed two boxes with shavings and also there is um, a plate with food and uh, a bowl with water for them. This area might seem too small for 11 puppies, but this is done on purpose. The reason why is that naturally puppies want to be clean. They will never poop and pee in their sleeping area. So when they wake up, their potty box is right ne next to them, is nearby. So when they step out of their sleeping area, they step into the potty box. As you can see, this is the first time they've seen the box and what they're doing, they are already using it. They have enough space to move around freely but they don't need too much space, otherwise um, they will misuse that space before they get trained. So what we are trying to do, we are trying to teach them to use a box with shavings and not to party in other areas, like nearby a plate with food or water, for example. We use um, pine shavings um, in our little boxes here. This time, before, we also used alfalfa pellets. Um, uh, there is a small risk that a puppy may choke on a pellet when um, trying to eat it. So we just decided to use uh, pine shavings just to be safe and not worry about uh, puppies choking on uh, a pellet. Cedar shavings have a stronger smell and they are not recommended for small puppies because they can give allergy and problems with breathing. So we use only pine shavings. Several puppies woke up and they're eating their solid food. It's um, um, ground beef with some water and uh, some soaked kibble that we use um, now to feed them. And it seems like they really like it. And it's uh, raw beef that we use. We use only lean, raw ground beef, and it has to be frozen at least seven days before given to puppies. We also used the goat's milk before, but one time, um, I think it was last year, uh, some puppies developed diarrhea after using goat's milk. So we decided not to use goat's milk anymore, just to avoid any um, chances of puppies developing diarrhea. What I'm doing right now is I am teaching this puppy to poop in the litter box. So I place him back. I know he wants to, um, to go potty, so I put him back into the box. So he goes in the right spot. Some puppies already go uh, into the box themselves as this little boy with blue color he just uh, went straight into the box after eating which is just great the puppies are smart animals and they the nature instinct tells them what to do The bowl with water might seem to be like in the way, but I placed it on purpose there. So um, when the puppies are in the box, 
sometimes you know they move around but the ball with water keeps them in the box so they have less chances of escaping and going somewhere else not in the box and of course they will not uh, party in their bed so the only place that they can go in are the two boxes with shavings It takes just one day to teach the puppies use uh, little boxes with shavings. All I have to do is stay with them and watch them. When I see that a puppy is going into a wrong spot to potty, I put the puppy into the box with shavings. It's not even a day. It's it's um, about an hour that I stay with puppies and watch them after I place uh, the, the boxes with shavings in their nest and um, I make sure that they use the area the right way. We don't allow mom to be with puppies when we first introduce the body box and um, uh, their first meal because when they uh, uh, hear and smell mom, they go after her and they will not learn to use the potty boxes or they will not learn to eat their new meal if mom is nearby. It is a late evening, about 11 p.m. now, and uh, the puppies have enough food to eat and not be hungry. After they eat this food, I will add some more food for them. Um, for the night in case they wake up and um, want to eat food will be nearby I will also add some pumpkin puree to make it taste delicious and just you know for additional nutrients that will help them feel full so those who have eaten go back into the bed area and they play with each other and then, of course, they go into the potty box to use it to, it to potty if they need to. As you can see, the boxes are used. The area around their football may seem to be messy, but that's okay. This is first time when they try solid foods and they are messy a little bit, but this mess is not the mess that they make when they party everywhere without having their party boxes in their kennel. If there are no party boxes with shavings, uh, the puppies will poop and pee everywhere and uh, the entire area will be so messy that it needs to be well cleaned several times a day every time they poop or pee we do not use pee pads to potty train puppies because they get very messy when they potty on pee pads and then they they and then they also confuse their bed with the pee pad and sometimes they can poop in their bed Pee pads may be okay to be used with um, small litters, like for example, palms and smaller size puppies when there is uh, less poop and uh, the puppies are not so messy. You just saw how a water bowl became a barrier for the puppies to party out of the box. Uh, the puppy stepped into the water and uh, felt that something was wrong so um and i helped the puppy by putting him back into the box so he can learn that the box is a better place to potty several puppies are full and they went to sleep together making a pile to be warm for some reason why my runner puppies always get cold after eating and they shiver. They get together in a pile and they uh, make each other warm by staying in a pile. 
The puppies liked their first meal and they finished eating all the food. So I will be giving them some more so kibble and uh, raw ground beef with some pumpkin puree for the night. And when they wake up, they can eat and not be hungry without mom. I'll just let you watch some more of how the puppies are moving around and are using the boxes for a few more minutes. And in the end of the video, I will show you how the puppies were using the box and how they were eating in the morning. Can you hear how they shiver? I also put the plate with food closer to the bed. So the plate is also a barrier for puppies. When they step out of their sleeping area, they will smell food and they will have to back up if they want to go potty. They will have to go into the box and not uh, into the space by their bed. Here you can see again how a water bowl is a barrier. This puppy was in the box but wanted to go somewhere else to potty, but he stepped into water and he went back into the box to potty in the right spot. This is what I saw when I came in the morning around 7 a.m. The puppies already were eating breakfast they were awake they were moving around and they were using the boxes with shavings to potty and their sleeping area is clean there is no mess they did not potty in their sleeping area they didn't uh, they didn't potty around their football the football was uh, almost empty they ate all the food that i left for them the area around the football was a little bit messy, yellow with pumpkin puree and uh, there was some kibble around uh, because the puppies probably stepped in the football, but that's okay. There was no bad mess and uh, the puppies party in the right area. The puppies run into the potty boxes themselves now. I don't have actually to place them in the box. And it seems like they've learned to potty in the right place, which makes me so happy. I stay nearby to watch what they do. And it looks like all puppies know where to go after they eat and um, they go into the right place to potty they did a great job by learning so quickly and uh, that's what needs to be done they do such a good job that i don't need to actually help them and i don't need to place them into the boxes they do it themselves We have one puppy who is trying to escape. A blue boy with yellow color wants to run away. Thank you so much for watching. Please stay for updates.
please give us a like and write the positive comment below the video to help our small channel grow. Puppies, puppies! Good puppies! You are good puppies! Good job! You are such good puppies! Good puppies! Good puppies! <laughs>